I didn't ever picture my life this way. One little steam on my clothes. Maybe I could fix things up so they'll go. I didn't ever think my life could be this fulfilling. Confucius said, Choose a job you love and you will never have to work a day in your life. We found that job when the universe brought us together at our favorite thing in the world. I'm sorry. There's no need to apologize. <laughs> this is my favorite tree. Oh, well, there is always room for one more hugger. I'm Luna, by the way. I'm Soleil. Okay, so technically, that was a lie. My name's Stephanie. But Luna and Soleil? Sun and Moon? It was just too perfect for me and my new best friend. Sometimes our voices sound alike, but you'll get used to it. This is Luna, by the way. Soleil. Luna. Soleil. Luna. Don't worry. You'll get used to it. In, In each, each other, other, we found our purpose. purpose. Snuggle Buddies! <laughs> Efficient delivery of nurturance. Everyone needs nurturing, even you. Did you know that without snuggles, you're 57% more likely to die 37% earlier than 24% of your friends? It's true. A good slow snuggle can also speed up your metabolism. And reduce your risk of gingivitis. We present to you a solution that will change your life. <laughs> variety of snuggle options. Snuggle Buddies tailors each experience to your snuggle needs, level of comfort, and of course your anonymity. anonymity. The human blanket. Tickle torture. The tight tuck. The your team's a loser but you'll always be a winner in my arms. The mommy's bosom. Ten dollars extra for binky. The too busy for a real relationship. Wrestling. Puppy love. The handy. And the blowy. So try Snuggle Buddies. When you don't have time for tenderness, tenderness has time for you. <laughs> well, we had our commercial. And business started booming. I think it was Mother Teresa who said, a vocation in which you serve your fellow human is a sure way to heaven. So we pleasured people the best way we knew how. But we were in uncharted territory. Snuggling was the Wild West. And we were the pioneers. We had not yet learned effective tools for keeping our hearts out of our work, or our work out of our hearts. In other words, we kind of f***ed things up. Enter Christopher Beige. Hi, I'm Luna. Your script? My script? Your contract? My contract? Your profile. My what? I'm just here to snuggle? Read the packet carefully. You must sign the confidentiality agreement before any physical contact can be made. I don't think we're gonna need all these papers. Send her away! Okay. I'm still gonna get paid, right? Of course. Please go now. Go. 
Go now, please go. Mommy. Wow, my first client rejection. This was gonna take some processing. Meanwhile, my personal life was totes a cluster. Enter Matt, my boyfriend. Ah! Oh my god, what are you doing? You just, you look so cozy in there. I thought I'd join you. Want to snuggle? Oh, I'm sorry, baby, not tonight. I'm so fried. But you're so good at it. It's because it's my job. Come on, baby. Just one little nuzzle. triggered my carpal tunnel. That's my tickle towards your hand. Do you mind getting me some ice? Sure. Okay, so I faked a sprain. But his golden retriever act was starting to get old. Am I an asshole? What is wrong with me? Hello? Hello? Hey. Hey, it's Matt. Yeah. Yeah, I was wondering, by chance, could you squeeze me in tonight? I, I need a cuddle. Bad. Yeah. Yeah, I'll pay. I needed a warm body against my pajamas. Even if it was just Matt. But, oh, beige. Sometimes you can get that tingly feeling about someone, even though they are very bad for you. Susie Toronto says, live a little, laugh a little, and love the one you're- Whoa, yeah. Luna's cuddles were no joke. She kind of gave me that tingly feeling. I knew it was wrong, but as Tim Gunn says, make it work. Make it work, man. Hey. Hey. Listen, hun, I'm sorry that I didn't want to cuddle the other day. It's just- No. I'm sorry. No, 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 I'm sorry. Hey. Come here. What's wrong with you? Uh, uh, nothing. I have a headache. It's not you. It's... I gotta go. I'll, I'll see you later. Ooh. My creepy Uncle Bernie used to say, don't shit where you eat. Boy, was he ever right. Where was Soleil anyway? We had just missed a career-changing snuggle that could have put us on the map with international cuddle execs from Tokyo. Soleil, where were you? We missed the cuddle. What do you mean? What are you talking about? <gasps> the puppy pilers got there first. The puppy pilers got there first. My girl! I was back. And I knew what I had to do. Find Beige and tell him that you can't treat a person like that. Not a business person or a person person. Remember me? I knew you were one of those. My mom was like you. Happy. Free. Slightly dirty. Hey, I may be a free spirit, but I'm very clean. She even smelled like you. Patchouli. She died on a commune, you know trampled by a cow, and she was a vegetarian. How unjust is that? I promised myself I would never fall for a girl who wore patchouli. I eat cow for every meal and snack. Hey, listen, man, I just...
you in the back. Could you, you know, tighten up? Get a little bit tighter? To... Yes. Oh, oh that's, mm -hmm. that's quite comfortable. Mm. Luna, how about a little tickle time? Put your paws in there. Get in that pit. Me tickle in the pit. Get in the pit. That's not, what is wrong with you today? That's not even, you're not even trying. You're not even in the game. It's beige, this asshole client of ours that rejected her. He's not an asshole. He's deep. So this beige is the reason that I can't get a good double smuggle? Would you like me to speak to him? I could talk to him. Would you like me to Excuse talk to him? Excuse me, Robert. We yeah. will tack this on at the end. We'll tack this extra tack time it on, on the that's end. That's right. Do you want me to talk to him? I can find out what the hell's going on. You would do that? You would talk to him? Sure. Thank you. Would you give him this note? I got ladies. I'm not paying for notes. All right? I'm sorry. Now let's talk him more huggy. It's time for pillow fight time. Okay. Pillow fight, you start and go over here, and then I go tradesies, and then samesies, and then... <laughs> You tell Marcus, 30,000 is my final offer. Man, you are intense. Will someone get this goddamn hippie out of my office? <sighs> ah! Ah! Matt, what are you doing here? I had to see you again. Matt, that was a one-time snuggle. But I, I can't stop thinking about you. Yes, you can. Your body is just reacting to the increase in oxytocin. It's not love. It's just a snuggle high. That's it, I'm calling the authorities. Okay, well, I guess you don't want this. Stay back. You are intense. I think you need more than a snuggle. What had I done? Maybe I really was that good a snuggler. You are my partner's boyfriend. Matt, I snuggled with you the same as I snuggle with all our customers. But you butterfly kissed me. So they told me you guys never butterfly kiss for money. You only do that if it's real. Warning, these moves are not for snuggle amateurs. Do not try this at home. Unless you sign up for our snuggle workshop. Call toll free and we can show you all of our advanced moves. Like this. Like this. I can't eat. Uh, I can't sleep. I can't, I can't even touch Sloy anymore. I gotta go. When did life get so complicated? I used to be able to fix everything with a snuggle. Now snuggling was ruining everything. Great, I'm gonna set up another point next week. <clears throat> I think I had just accidentally been a big to Soleil. I think I had just accidentally been a big to Luna. George Eliot may have said, sometimes you need to re-examine what a you are before you can put your in someone else. Jack Kerouac probably said, a person's worth is only fully realized after you remove your from them. So I say, when you don't know what to do, go back to what you know. Give some time and space, and what you know will flow. Hello, Hello tree. I'm never gonna cry. Ba -dum -bum -bum.